Hey y'all, it's American Mom. I'm going to be reacting to Lost, Season 1, Episode 6. Very excited. I like all the backstories that we're getting um, lately uh, since Kate's and then um, Mr. Locks and then last week Jax was really touching. And I know in the comments y'all were telling me like there's more that's going to be happening with each character. Like I'm going to learn more about that, the backstory. It was just kind of um, an introduction to like who everybody is. So I think maybe we'll be getting another one. I'm ready to watch this episode. I'm very excited. So let's do this. Is it going to be her in the... Yeah. Oh. Oh, he's a waiter. Okay. I hope they know each other before tonight. Okay. Okay. I want to go to the house. I think he's a good guy down deep. He's so possessive of her, though. A happy backstory, maybe? Or did something go wrong? Because she looks at him really weird now. Wow. Hey, you stepped on her flowers. We just went from a nice moment to that. Somebody stop him. Where's Harley? Yeah, saw your uh, yeah. Oh, and then his son is to see that as well. I'd love to see him walking. Keep an eye out for any medical supplies. Drugs in particular. Drugs. Right. I'm gonna need to know why Charlie's on the stuff later. Yeah, you're better out. Don't move. Look, I was just gonna take you. not move. Oh, there's an animal nearby. What's going on? <laughs> He's standing on a beehive. What's the beehive doing there? I was just walking the beach with my son. And all of a sudden, this dude is all up on me. Mm. I didn't do anything. Chikura! But in the United States of America, where I'm from, Korean people don't like black people. Do you know that? Kuzuma Ajima! So maybe you ought to talk to him! You know what? People don't like people. Stay on. What? Mm. Yeah. Aww. Did he die? Why is she not happy about that? Those were dead days in the mafia. Mother of all that's not dead. You know what? If you were allergic, there's no epipen on the island. Doesn't seem to be any major trauma to the bones. There's another one over here. Someone laid them to rest here. Who? I don't know. Where would they come from? Didn't you guys shoot a polar bear last week? It takes 40 or 50 years for clothing to degrade like this. Oh. What is it? I don't thought of C's actually. <laughs> Sorry. I 
Oh, they lived nice. She has Chanel. I don't have Chanel. I don't care for it, but... <laughs> oh, that's those wrinkly dogs. 당신의 꽃 한송이가 내 인생의 전부였을 때? 응? These caves make too good a shelter just to be used for burial. Adam and Eve, they must have lived here. Their plane crashed, or maybe they were shipwrecked. They probably found this place and knew they could survive here. Unlimited supply of fresh water. Tree canopy keeps the temperature the down. Shields out the sun. Yeah. The openings are narrow, easier for protection against predators. We don't need to bring the water to the people. We need to bring the people to the water. We're moving camp. I think we could live. The hell? Is that blood on your hands? He's in the mafia. Oh. What have you done? You don't want to. You don't want to. So that everybody could have fresh water and we could get the infirmary off the beach. You think it's a bad idea? No. No, it makes sense. But? I just thought you were checking her out. <laughs> Drive shaft. You played bass. And guitar. <laughs> On a couple of tracks. You really heard of us? Well. A lot of wreckage, it might still turn oh, undamaged, still playable. And the dog things. untouched. I mean, I wish, good. But not everybody knows about the thousand miles. Slowly, a little course. bit at a time, a little bit. Let them know that first, then they can decide. Mary Jo, Tangshin Nampenina, Tangshin Abojiga, Tangshin Chaki is a Muslim leader than Jasu Tanango. Tangshin Nampenina Tashi Huayan and Gonoteo. 대답해봐요. 예? 갈 때까지 당신은 조용히 가만히 있어야 돼. 아우. 그 후엔 당신이 원하는 대로. I need to talk to you. <웃음> Are y'all proud of me? I suspected that. You speak English? Yes. What? You speak English. Those are the lessons. It's a question of honor. You call trying to kill me in front of my kid honor. You don't know my father. Tell us. I need your help. What I know is that this island just might give you what you're looking for, but you have to give the island something. You can do that. You really think you can find my guitar? Look up, Charlie. You're not gonna ask me to pray or something. Mm -hmm. I want you to look up. Is it stuck in a tree? Ah! <laughs> Aw, he just had to be willing to give the, the drugs up. Go get it. Just what is it that you did? You had your chance to know. Yeah. You said you didn't want to know, and I did. You know, I know you can't understand a word. And normally I'm not the talking out loud type, but since I have a captive audience, I hope for your sake you pay attention. <laughs> Stay away from me. And my kid. Is that what she asked him to do? To scare the bejesus out of him? Time's it. There's her car. She didn't do it. She's scared.
guitar back. Hello? What's this? The tenants. Y'all's backstory. Can I ask you something? Anything you want, man. When's your birthday? You and <laughs> it's a good episode. Another good episode. I like knowing the backstories. Like ever since they crashed and we've seen this Korean couple, I'm like, he seems so in control of her and, you know, um, we're only going to stick together and don't talk to anybody else. And you come here. And, and I knew, I thought maybe both of them could speak English and they were just keeping it um, from everybody else and just acting like they didn't understand. But she did. And she couldn't let her husband, which he still doesn't know, that she was about to leave him at the airport. Hmm. She would not be on that island. I don't know how this is going to go, you know, moving forward with, is she, will she eventually let him know, like, or will we eventually find out um, what did her dad do? Like, because she wanted to get away from her father and her husband. And from what the lady was saying, you know, you stay out of sight until they think you're dead. Like, you got to part ways and want to part ways pretty badly to fake your own death, which is what she was doing. She was just going to be kidnapped. She's going to disappear and then stay gone long enough that they had to presume she was dead. So she could live her life and not have her husband come home um never saw him physically beating her but she just was she knew that him working with her dad whatever that is he would come home with blood on him and it wasn't his blood and they had nice things but that's probably how she grew up and she knows what maybe he'll turn in to be and she just wanted the man back that was um, when they when they apparently but, well, not when they met. That's when we saw them because he kissed her that night. So they knew each other before that. But he was a waiter at a restaurant. And that wasn't good enough for the dad. He wanted him to, you know, be something. But what he became is something that she was falling out of love with. I'm very interested to see where that's going to go on this island. I... Him beating the crap out of Michael. I've learned his name now is Michael. I've probably heard it for the first five episodes, <laughs> but I just didn't know um, his first name. I knew the kid's name was Walt and the dog's name was Vincent, but I didn't know his name. I was just like, it's his dad. I, I mean, him drowning Michael, I mean, trying to, at the beginning was just ridiculous. I was like, is it because he found out that, you know, Michael saw his wife when she was um, in the, you know, in the woods that time. She was naked. <sighs> it was over a watch. But I'm sure there's more to that story. Um, her father's watch and someone else taking it, like, there's something else. There's something else to that. Um... So they're going to live in the cave. Well, some of them are. And some of them are staying on the beach. I don't understand why they just can't... I don't know. Is it a half-day trek up to this cave? I mean, send someone down every couple days. And with the luggage, spell out help. SOS. Something. And check on it every now and then. And everybody live in the cave. Why not? It's hot. It's going to be rainy. It's going to be... Where's Claire? Where's the pregnant lady? Was she in the cave? I, I mentioned that she needs to get in the cave. She needs to get off the beach, but I didn't see her this episode, I don't think. So now we've got two groups. Okay. That's fine. 
I want some more backstories. I think that's interesting. And Kate and Jack, I don't know. She wants to stay. He thinks it makes sense to stay in the cave. Um, so I don't know what's up with that. And now he wants to know her backstory. Now he wants to know what she did. And she said, you had your chance. <sighs> I want to know as well, Jack. Don't be so selfish. I'm sure I'll find out, but now I gotta wait. It's all right. Charlie's off drugs. Mr. Lock got him off drugs and he got his guitar. That was, that was really nice. He gave something up and then he knew where his guitar was. He was just waiting on him to, to want it bad enough. I like Mr. Locke. I like everybody. I still have a question mark over Sawyer's head because I need to know his backstory. I want to know why he's so cocky and arrogant and with his little dimples. He's nice looking. He's just, um, I don't know, the way he talks to everybody. He hasn't really meshed with anybody else on the island. So I'm wondering why. I'm wondering what that's about. And then maybe if I understand his backstory, then I'll kind of, maybe he'll kind of grow on me a little bit. But yeah, um, this was a great episode. I really enjoyed that. Um, thank y'all for watching me, as always. Um, and until the next video and the next time. Bye.